My name is Brian King. I am an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator and welcome to StampWithBrian.com. I love color and I love playing with color and I love creating wonderful color combinations. You may have heard me say before that a great inspiration for color combinations is our designer series papers or any of the cards that are included in our annual catalog or occasions catalogs. But today I'm going to show you how to create your own color combinations uh, in hopes that you might feel inspired to give some of these a try yourself. So come on in and let's chat. I've torn apart my color coach. These little screws come right out and I have gathered all of the colors into groupings. I have the greens, the reds, the yellows, the neutrals, the blues, the purples, and the oranges. You can group these in any way that you feel comfortable. But what I want to uh, talk to you today about is how you can use these colors, which incidentally you could do this with your own pieces of cardstock, but how you can use your own colors to create your own combinations that you love. So what I'm going to do real quick, I'm going to just pick three colors, one from each of these families. And uh, these have not been planned ahead. I'm going to pick this purple, and I'm going to pick this yellow, and I'm going to pick this green. Now, I don't know why and I don't know how, but those look lovely together. I never would have picked Wisteria Wonder, Crushed Curry, and Pistachio Pudding, but I could very easily create a lovely card made with that. I'm going to give another go. I'm going to pick Lost Lagoon, Pumpkin Pie, and what is this? Strawberry Slush. What a beautiful combination of colors. I've got a blue, I've got an orange, and I've got a pink. Let's do it one more time. I'm going to go with, this is like playing poker, uh, Wasteer, uh, Wild Wasabi, let me just pick a blue, uh, Marina Mist, and So Saffron. So again, a beautiful combination with three different colors. If you really want to play with these, I would suggest in this case, they're all in the subtles category, but picking one that's a dark, uh, one that's a regal, one that's a uh, subtles, you know, playing around with the, the groupings of the colors. And also, don't forget your neutrals. These play a huge role in any wonderful color combination. I'm often asked, how do I create color combinations that work for me? And this is it. I love just seeing the full colors and comparing them with colors in other families and in other uh, shades. So on the back of these cards, there are co suggested color combinations. Sometimes I go to there, but for the most part, I pick three colors and it always seems to work. I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial. For more information, please visit me at stampwithbrian.com.